A big show of support to the St. Charles County Police Department and their canine officer, Bonnie, this afternoon. New at 6, Fox 2's Patrick Clark shows us how the retiring canine was giving a tail wagging send off into retirement today. It's a dog's life, or at least it will be, for retiring canine officer Bonnie. A header walks outside and naps in the sun, head scratches, and treats for a well deserved retirement. But first, it's one last lap around the building for this school resource officer. This is her retirement day. Uh, she's been in service for eight and a half years with the St. Charles County Police Department. For most of her career, she's been electronic storage detection canine. Uh, we were assigned to the cybercrime unit for St. Charles County Police Department. But last year, the last school year, 23-24 school year, we transition out of cyber crimes and into the schools. On her last day at Becky David Elementary School Friday, a large gathering of students, teachers, and St. Charles County law enforcement wanting to wish a fond adieu to a dear member of the Francis House School District and St. Charles County Police Department. Uh, and I know how much they love her. A lot of these kids depend on her every day. It's been tough. You know, um, I still, you know, she still gets to come home with me, you know, and she's still now just going to be retired and be my pet and be part of, continue to be part of my family. But after um, she, you know, as canine officers, you spend more time with your canine partner than you do with your family. And Officer Oldani getting a new partner, a six-month-old canine on the way. But on this Friday, it's cake for Bonnie. Her new duties will be just to uh, hang out, probably uh, sleep late, uh, get spoiled, and uh, uh, hopefully not gain too much weight. <laughs> In St. Charles County, Patrick Clark, Fox 2 News.